John Rhodes Cobb, initially a fur trader, transitioned to auto racing and set numerous endurance records with his Napier Railton car. In 1935, Cobb commissioned Reed Anthony Railton, head engineer at Thompson & Taylor, to design a land speed record car. Railton had previously worked on Malcolm Campbell's land speed record car, the Campbell Railton Rolls-Royce Bluebird, which set a record of 301.129 miles per hour in September 1935. Cobb offered Railton the freedom to design a land speed record car from scratch, resulting in the Railton, named after its designer. The Railton was designed with four-wheel drive, powered by two Napier Lion W12 aircraft engines, each driving a separate axle. The car's frame was a single central boxed girder made from high-strength steel, with the engines staggered on either side. The body was designed to be aerodynamic and lift-free, with a removable upper section for easy access to the car's internals. The Railton was 28 feet long, 8 feet wide, and weighed 6,280 pounds. Cobb debuted the Railton to the press in April 1938 and began testing it at the Bonneville Salt Flats in August. After initial setbacks and modifications, Cobb set new land speed records on September 15, 1938, with an average speed of 350.20 miles per hour over the mile and 350.10 miles per hour over the kilometer. However, George Easton broke Cobb's record the following day in his Thunderbolt car. Cobb returned to England and modified the Railton, improving its cooling system, engine performance, and aerodynamics. In August 1939, he set new land speed records at 368.86 miles per hour over the mile and 369.74 miles per hour over the kilometer. He also set new records for longer distances. With the outbreak of World War II, the Railton was placed in storage, and Cobb served as a pilot. After the war, Cobb had the Railton restored and made further modifications, including the addition of a device to prevent engine stalls during gear changes. In September 1947, Cobb set a new land speed record at 394.197 miles per hour. The Railton held the land speed record for piston-powered, wheel-driven cars for many years, and Cobb's record stood until 1964. The Railton is currently on display at the Think Tank Birmingham Science Museum.